Hey, it is me, Magic Maddie Murthwaite. I am here, the international medium and spirit writer. I have just finished writing with spirit and I have a message for you today. It is a very special message and it is an answer to a question. Is honesty the best policy? So here goes, hot off the press. Oh, what a web we weave when we pamper to the egos of others. We lessen who we are. Every time we say or do something in search of the approval of others, we lose sight of the source that created us. We are all guilty of this, some in a lesser degree, while others respond by default in this way. The real culprit that needs to be eradicated is fear. The fear of being rejected. Full stop. We know that many don't like confrontation and drama, but we know too that those same beings abhor lies. <sighs> so why would you then choose to lie to yourself? Is honesty the best policy? We know that once you deceive yourself, you start on a journey of contamination, contaminating your thoughts, your feelings, and your soul. Should we always say and do the right thing? For we know that some of you believe it is right not to offend and tread carefully the, with the words that are placed on your tongue and erred through your mouth. We know too about the biblical references that you subscribe to, doing unto others as thy shall have done unto thyself. But you see, life is a conundrum when we do not spend time surveying ourselves, learning what feels right in that moment honoring that we are doing the best we could from right where we are, not by measuring our actions against others' opinions and in doing so diluting our authenticity. Feeling guilty and beating ourselves up as we do, we know as we have heard every word. It is simply a waste of your beautiful energy. It transports you back down to earth to a lower vibration that can't serve you or your true heart's desires. So as you live from a plane of uncertainty and muddle your way through returning time and again back to the place you left yourself at, we encourage you to focus on what is certain and what will always be true to you, no matter what. We ask that you spend time in a higher vibration alongside your beautiful higher self. And when you feel yourself being pulling down towards the fear, far away from your real truth, we ask you to pause. Maybe meditate, take a nap, distract yourself, take any small step backwards towards your higher vibration and lessen the vibration that is keeping you stuck. I am Magic Maddie Murthwaite. May God bless all of you. And thank you for listening. Please subscribe to my page if you've enjoyed today's little spiritual morsel or join me for daily guidance at Instagram at Maddie Murthwaite. I look forward to connecting with you very soon. May God bless you. Namaste.